Good morning, uh, this is Ellen Castro here at Fitness Unlimited. This is Sam Yates, she's also a personal trainer here. Uh, we're gonna go over today uh, about the squat uh, and how important that is to add it to your uh, routine. Um, we wanna go over some key points as far as feet and as far as back. Uh, we wanna make sure we get this proper, the proper technique before we try to load any weight before we try to put a bar behind your back. Um, for beginners, I would normally recommend to warm up first and then um, maybe do two sets of 10 to 15 reps. Uh, try to go down slow and then come up um, gradually or fast. Um, for a advanced athlete, you can um, warm up with two sets of 10 and then add a bar to your back and then eventually add some weights um, as long as you keep the good form. Uh, we're going to go over the squat. She's going to have her feet um, outside of her hips. Her toes are going to be pointing out slightly. And she's going to go ahead and demonstrate her own squat. And we're going to cue her and see if we can fix her a little bit and maybe get her to do a better squat. Go ahead, Sam. Show us a couple. Maybe one, one or three. Good. Good job. Let's do another one. And pause. Pause right there. So I want her to actually get her knees to track in her toes. So push away with your knees. And I want you to keep your chest in slightly up. Good, and then back up. All right, so she's had some experience with it. Show us some common faults you see with people. So they're leaning too much forward. About the, the toes, they come up on, on the toes. So their heels are off the ground. Um, you always want to keep your weight on your heels. Show me one that is the worst one you've ever seen. The knees stay in. So um, all these things are going to cause you to round your back mainly. Uh, and, and in our world, that's the biggest thing that most people have problems with, their lower back. So if we can keep that area the safest by promoting good technique with your squat, um, you will stay healthier and you will keep coming to the gym and you're going to get more benefits from the workout. All right, so some muscle areas that you will uh, work while you're doing the squat, um, you're going to work your quads, you're going to work your hamstrings, also your lumbar area, your abdominals. If you have a weight on your back, your whole body will be engaged, your back will be engaged, your hands will be engaged. Pretend you have a bar on your back, um, her hands are also working. So this is actually, you can stand up Sam, this is actually one of the best exercises you can do. Um, if, you, if I had to choose one that, uh, to pick, if I was told, look, you only get to pick one exercise, this would be the one because it works your whole body once you have a bar on your back. Even if you had dumbbells in your hands, you're working your entire body. So this is the one to do.